You know, I was talking to a certain lady. On Sunday, I had a meeting of uh, believing women. They came. They came to visit. I send you people clips. I'm sure you saw a few clips here and there. And there's a lady, she's so good in mobilizing. And she mm. will bring people. You tell her, mommy, I'm looking for a meeting. Bring 50 women. She will quickly bring them. Then, uh, and she will always direct them. Musika Ichini, we are praying. They will stand and pray. But you know, when I, I talk to her, and these women, can you, she says, no, me, I can't be a pastor. You know me, I cannot. But I tell her, what you are doing, you are already pastoring these you are women. Pastoring. <laughs> yeah, you, they listen to you. What you tell them, they listen, they obey. When you say we are going to pray, they are praying. They, you are pastoring them. That is what it means. But you see, this woman already feels, mm -mm. people will think that I want to be like a man. I told her, no. You can still be a woman and be pastor. Mm. Still be a woman and be pastor. <laughs> so that is, uh, I just say the way we deal with the limitation, we have said we be humble, have wisdom, then go to the root of the limitation and look at if there are God imposed limitations, understand there are restrictions that are supposed mm -hmm. to guide or restrain you from doing some things mm -hmm. and you work along with them. Mm -hmm. You move like Paul. With a thorn in the flesh, yet you are still moving with it. Mm. I don't know if there is anything mm. else you'd like to add. Teresia, Pastor Jennifer, anybody, Mama? Uh, I would like to encourage people, especially those who are not born again, and maybe who think that maybe Jesus came for those who are born again, or those who do not lead sinful lives. Jesus actually came for everyone. Mm. So maybe there is someone there outside who is feeling like, oh, I'm a sinner, just, just like Zacchaeus. Remember, Zacchaeus was a tax collector and mm. he used to charge people. That's the reason he got a lot of wealth. His wealth was gotten by overcharging people. So if you are there, you are feeling like you are a sinner, Jesus cannot accept me, just learn from the story that we've just given. Jesus came for us all, even for those who have committed sins. Come to Jesus the way Jesus came, uh, sorry, the way Zacchaeus came down. Mm. Come to Jesus, repent your sins, accept Christ as your personal savior, and you will see God guiding you. You will even be able to break limitations in your life limitations in your family, career, job, businesses, even limitations in your health. And as you get born again, remember to keep the faith and not fall into temptations again. Matthew 26, 41. Therefore, limitations will be broken and we must keep watch and pray so that we don't enter into temptation again. Praise God. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Amen. Yes, yes, yes. Mama, Amen. what do you say? Amen. Finally, finally, I want us to pray. If you have anything to say, Pastor Jennifer? Uh, not much, but one thing I have seen uh, that has troubled women in ministry Amen. is uh, things that we have seen trouble ministers even in the Bible. When you don't have wholesome leadership not that it's bad leadership but it's not wholesome you want to be very careful and pray to god to bring the right godly influences over your life and in your life people who speak to you people who speak for you and people who speak over you mm. david had a limitation mm. in one area family <laughs> david fought 66 battles and lost none mm. David is a man God testifies that he was after his own heart. Everything he asked him to do, he did, but filled with family. The man who raised him, Samuel, filled with family. Samuel died and none of his sons could step in ministry because he had groomed none. Prospered in ministry, never prospered at home. Why? Mm -hmm. The person who raised Samuel was Eli, the same, same thing. He missed to train his own sons. So I've seen women in ministry raised by good mentors, but they are not wholesome. 
-hmm. You want a mentor who is wholesome. What do I mean by wholesome? Nothing missing, nothing lacking. They are not just building your calling. They are not building the oil of God upon you. They are not just exposing you to ministry. They are also building the woman in you, the wife in you, the mother in you. Mm -hmm. When God calls us, motherhood is a part of our ministry. What being a wife is part of our ministry. It's not. It's not like we, we are doing this as because of gender role, and then we step into ministry. No, it's still ministry. It's just, just a different facet of our ministry. So, so I've seen people misled. I have met with people who thought because there are meetings I couldn't take at a certain point, and there are meetings I can't take at a certain time. And you. One of them was a seminar and I told them at so-so time I have to be home. My husband had traveled and I didn't want him to come home and I'm not home. And you see the, 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 the look on their faces. Why would mm. you let a man sit on you when you carry this, this kind of an anointing? Again, those are people who have been led, but it's not wholesome. Because the closer you get to God, the more intimate you get with him, the more you get to know him, the more wisdom he builds in you. Mm. God, we have to be careful of our influences. We want to be sure we are good roots who are following good Naomi's. <laughs> if I can yes. put it there. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Mm. So I don't know who may listen to mm. this broadcast. You want to be sure you're following people who are wholesome. They're not just building one part of your life. Exactly. Or sometimes you have one who builds this side, another one who builds the other side. So, mm. because you can't dictate who God uses in your life. He brings whoever he wants. There are some people who address the mother in you. There are those who address the minister in you, but you want to make sure you are growing up whole. If that oh. makes sense. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you so much. Mama, anything before we pray? No, I just want to apologize again. <laughs> you went to again. I don't know what happened, but um, my client is just was just bringing some kind of complication. That's why I said, let me land there and 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 calm her down and and come. And I thought uh, I, I I might do Zoom there because I always do some Zoom there, but today is like it didn't. It didn't happen. <laughs> mm, mm. I apologize. Some, some things are spiritual, mm. Mama. Some things are spiritual. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Mm. But I thank you um, for everything. I thank you for yeah, praying for Mercy for standing with her. She really, we were really afraid because of this time. And ah, God just fought for us and we Praise Amen. God for that. Amen. 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 Yes, she's home, recovering. God, Lord. And although we cannot even go to see her, <laughs> mm. because uh, she she's supposed to quarantine for 14 days, so mm. she has just to be by herself. Yes. Mm. God is in her. We keep praying. Mm. God is making. He that started it will complete it. Amen. We make everything perfect concerning Amen. her. And we Amen. say that uh, our children shall be kept of the Lord. Amen. Especially during Amen. this time, we are kept of the Lord. And that is the same thing that will happen to our children Amen. in the name of Jesus Amen. Christ. Amen. Yeah, I would like us Amen. to pray. I'd like Amen. us to just wind up with praying. And uh, mm -hmm. first, we are going to just pray. Each one of us, we, we ask God to give us grace. Yeah. Grace to deal with our limitations. Those that mm -hmm. we can overcome, mm -hmm. deal with them. Those that are restrictions, may we know that they are. And we, we also stay out of the enemy zone. Mm -hmm. so I just want us to lift our voices and tell God, mm -hmm. Father, help me, help me, Father, in Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord. We ask for grace, God. We have fallen short, oh my Father. We have asked for grace, oh limitations, oh Lord God. Grace and cannot stretch enough at the Father. We have help us help us open our inner eyes open yes. our inner ears open yes. our antenna sensitize our spiritual antenna yes. God, to know what limitations to deal with to know what limitations you have allowed to protect us god in the name of jesus we thank you god 
Thank you. Jesus. Just as we are praying, just as we are praying, this word came to me, just as we are praying, that without limitations, you cannot see God. Mm. 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 Without limitations, we cannot see God. Mm. So limitations is a very positive. Is positive. It's not negative the way we understand it in the physical. Mm. Limitations is very positive because God mm. begins where our strength reaches. Ah, so the more limited you are, the mm. more of God that you'll have in your life. Glory to God. Amen. Hallelujah. Jesus. Yes, Lord. David saying it was good that I was afflicted. For nature, you taught my hands to warm and my fingers to battle. Thank you, God, for limitations that you bring to draw us near to you. Limitations so that your strength can show up. Jehovah, we thank you. We thank you, God. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, King. Hallelujah. Jesus. Mighty name. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. During this time, I've been praying a prayer that I just love. It is in Isaiah chapter 30. Isaiah 30 and verse 30. The Bible says, the Lord will cause his glorious voice to be heard and show the descent of his arm with the indignation of his anger and the flame of a devouring fire, mm-hmm. with the scattering tempest and hailstorm. Verse 31, for through the voice of the Lord, Assyria will be beaten down as he strikes with the rod. We want God to cause his glorious voice to be heard over the nation. Amen. That so there may be healing, physical mm-hmm. healing, spiritual healing, mm-hmm. healing in the economy, healing in every aspect of our lives. All mm-hmm. the nations of the world are suffering, and we just mm-hmm. want to ask God, Lord, cause your glorious voice to be heard. Because what mm-hmm. that one say, through the voice of the Lord, mm-hmm. the Assyrian, that tormentor, will be beaten down in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Father, we come before you Thank again. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Ah, cause, oh, your voice to be heard. cause your glorious ah, voice to be heard. Cause your voice to be heard. Oh, Let Jesus. your glorious voice be oh, heard, oh my Father. Hallelujah. Across the nations, Jehovah God. Lord, I was Father, that you the down. Lord, whatever all the social problems it has come with, the mental sicknesses it has come with, my Father calls your glorious voice to be heard. That this as material may be written down. Calls your glorious voice, O Lord, to be heard. That the Assyrian may be written down. The Assyrian, the enemy that has been we know that through your glory of voice, my father, the enemy will be beaten down. the mighty We bless you, Lord. We bless you, Lord. We For his wonderful There's no one like you, my father. No one is ever fair to you. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name. Thank you, Jesus. During this time, we have first issues. We are going to draw a prayer from uh, to pray for the church, drawn from Matthew chapter 5. Mm-hmm. The issues, I know the church has been mocked. Probably, mm-hmm. I don't know if Pastor Jennifer, the people, you people in the U.S. face that. But in yep. Kenya, we are, the church is so mocked. The yeah. things that are said are something else. But I've said, you don't blame them. We have failed to be the salt. Mm. Our saltiness is not being felt. That's why mm. people can say anything. But if they know that we are the salt of the world, of the earth, I mean, they feel it, they will have respect. They will have respect for you the way they have respect for the salt they put in their vegetables. Mm. But we are, the church has been mocked as well. Oh, can't you why, oh, look at them, look at them. A lot of mockery that has gone on. Mm. Times we have failed to stand up to be the salt of the earth, to be the light of the world.
that we are supposed to be. And that is why I want us to pray for the church of Christ, that the Thank church you. of Christ shall stand as the salt and the light of the world. In the mighty name of Jesus. Father, we give you pray for your church again. We can be praying for the special Catholics. We are 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 praying for the again because they will see that we are following the bring of Christ and we have the name of Jesus and the name of my father may our saltiness be Jehovah we shall not be thrown away my father and my father let our saltiness be fair in the union of the church in the sickness of my father my father let the light of the church of my father Return of the universe. So whenever we enter, we shall not appear again in the mighty name of the Lord. God, we pray that Jehovah God, the light of the church, shall be driven across the nature of the world. We shall pray in the name of the Lord. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. Bless you, Lord. Oh, Father, we stand in this. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Amen. I would like us to pray. The last prayer we are praying for our families. We are going to read a psalm aloud. Let us just turn to Psalm 23 and we will read it aloud. That will be a prayer that we are praying for ourselves and our families. Psalms what? 23? 23. We will read it in whatever version you have. Mine is New King James. Teresia, which one do you have? What version King of the Bible? Version? King James. King James. Yes. Yes. You Mine say Psalms what? 23. Psalm 23. 23? 23. Just the whole of it. We want to read the whole of it together. Okay. Pastor Jennifer, what Bible? NIV. NIV. Mama, what Bible do you have? NIV too. Mm -hmm. Okay. So let us go. <clears throat> verse 1. The Lord Psalm is not three, three, verse my one. Shepherd, my I shall Lord. not want. Not verse 2. He, he makes me lie me down. Makes me lie down. He leads he leads me, me beside the still water. He refreshes my soul. Verse three. He restores my soul. My soul. He guides me, me, me along him. the right path he for His name's name sake. sake. Verse four. Yeah. Even though I won't walk in the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. I will fear no evil. For you, you, you are with me. 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 Surely, surely, your goodness and love will follow, follow me all, all the days of my life, of my life. and I will dwell in, in the house of the Lord, house of the Lord forever. forever. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. So close Amen. for us. Close for us. Close Amen. for us with a word of prayer. Close for us, Mama. Mm -hmm. so. What did you say? Close for us with a word of prayer. Pray for us okay. as we pray. Yes. Father, in the name of Jesus, we come to you again this yes. morning, oh Father. Father, we say thank you. Thank you for, uh, mm. for the meeting that you mm. prepared for us, oh Lord. Father, we, I want mm. to thank you for Pastor Jennifer. I want to thank you for Pastor Jenua Silva. I want to thank you for Sister uh, Teresa. Father, bless these ladies. Bless those who, who didn't even have time to come and join the meeting today. Oh, my Father, I pray mm -hmm. that you bless them. 
I pray that you bless us. I pray that you bless this meeting, mm -hmm. Father. And the next time we meet, oh Lord, mm -hmm. may you, Father, bless us. Mm -hmm. May you bless our, our meeting, mm -hmm. oh Lord. May you mm -hmm. bless our families, Jehovah. May you mm -hmm. anoint us. May you anoint our families. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Father. We praise you. We worship mm -hmm. you. We exalt your name. I pray this believing in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. 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 Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Jennifer, look at Jennifer. Oh, Jennifer you, is joining us now. <laughs> you know, I think because the last time we met was at four was around four o'clock. So my oh. mind was imprinted it was four o'clock. Oh. So I'm, I'm even coming in, I'm saying, I know I'm up about 15, 15, 20 minutes late, but I was still coming. <laughs> and then I had you pray, the conclusion prayer. I'm like, wait, I thought it was four o'clock because I thought that the, la the last time we met was at four o'clock. <laughs> <laughs> it is okay. It was at four o'clock to see my sister. Oh, okay. but then the way oh. it's good to see you. Good to, to see, see you. To say see something. You. <laughs> I'll, I'll join next time but we are blessed we are not limited amen, amen. we are just, amen. We'll just we'll just exercise the, the Zacchaeus he was desperate desperate to yes. see Jesus amen and even with, with all the desperation that he had when Jesus came to meet him where he was sometimes we struggle so much to to find Jesus Mm. But he's able to come and bring us to the place where, you know, we are face to face with him. We don't have mm -hmm. to climb up so high. Mm. But I think mean, the, the idea of having that desperation, that deep desire. Amen. To me, Amen. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We will yeah, how are you all? We <laughs> are well. Uh, yeah, well. And Jennifer had surgery. That's why we didn't have her last time. And oh, she, yeah. she's still recovering. Oh. That's why you look look at her. She's always in a cast. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Well. We thank but God. I'm okay. I, I'm very mm. well. Amen. Amen. Yeah, the Lord has done a fine work. Amen. Amen. Yeah. Oh, really? We'll meet again right. next time. Mm. God bless you. Amen. The time bless can you go too. now. Thank you so much. <laughs> Where yes, is the and I've seen Miss Mutama. I didn't meet Miss Mutama last time. Mm -hmm. uh, Sorry, I was working during the night. Ah. I was on shift that time, but I explained oh. to Mr. Thank okay. you, ladies. Uh, Jennifer, we were saying we were. Uh, oh, Teresa was uh, talking. Pleasure to meet you, ladies. God bless you. Amen. Nice Amen. You Amen. <laughs> Amen. See you God again bless. in two weeks. In two Amen. weeks, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Thank you, Daniel. Three o'clock. Mm -hmm. I'll check the time this time. Please. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Baraka okay, Tele. Okay. You Bless too, you. Pastor. Thank you so much. Thank <laughs> you. Thank you. Thank you. See you, Pastor Jennifer. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> see you. See you, Pastor Baraka. Dr. Ali, thank you. Welcome back. Kindly. <laughs> Jennifer, thank you. Uh, your daughter is out of the hospital. She was discharged yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> yes, hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Yes. Thank you, it lady. Well with the righteous, we bless God. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you. God bless. God bless. <laughs>